box for May. Here are the little cards that came with it. I already threw away the box, but here's the card that came with it. And if you want to read that, I'll let you pause it so you can do so. Let me know if you prefer me reading it or if you prefer reading it yourself. And then they give you this thing that tells you how to do this certain look. And then it shows the look on the front. Here are the two stamping polishes it came with. It came with this really pretty purple that's got a slight shimmer to it. And it's called Shattered. They gave us glass and it's a sheer kind of turquoisey color. And it's really nice as well. It came with these little holographic flakies. I'm not gonna open it because it's, uh, they, let's see, it's already coming out. Some of them are stuck to the side of the thing. But you just rub these on your nail. They're called Crushed. I wanna get more of their powders, but they're a little pricey. I think they're like $10, a, $10 a little uh, pod. You can pause it if you want to get a good look at it. I really love the dragonflies. This is Manny and Me 56, 056. And because I'm not really sure what I want to do on my own nails yet, I've, I've prepared some sticks yesterday so that I could play around. If you want to get this box, go ahead and sign up now and um, with your first box you'll get a first box you'll get a stamper and a scraper and it comes with this these and the uh, flakies oh and if it's your first box you'll get a stamper and a, and a scraper Real quick, I wanted to show y'all something else. Is um, a while back, before I even knew that they were gonna release these at some point, I got these last year. These are these like translucent, translucent, translucent stamping polishes. But I'm gonna be using them in, uh, using them to color in. It was a, I believe, a collection that I got, and it came with all, um, all of these seven polishes. I'll let you look at the tops real quick. So we've got like a pinky purplish kind of. It's like a light pink curl. It's called Vermilion. Garden Gnome. Sunny Day. Ocean Depths. Poppy Seed. Violet Spectrum. I'm not going to use those to stamp. I'm going to use them to color in. I'm thinking I want to stamp in black. And I might use this to color in as well. And this one, it was called Glass. I've already stamped them on the top there, so you can just look at them. How they're stamped on there. That's how they look. I'm going to do um, a black outline. What's cool with these is instead of doing a reverse stamp method where, uh, where you stamp it and color it in on the stamp or stamp it to a little thing of clear coat like if I were to lay down a decal and make a decal instead of doing that you can just stamp it and then color it in as you want to on the nail Pretty sure they still sell these on the Maniology site, but they're little rose quartz rock. And it's a real rock. It's a real rose quartz. What's nice about these is rock or any kind of painting dish really will keep your polishes cold so they don't dry out as fast. Kind of draw this out and get it thinned out. This is how you can kind of not pick up so much at once. I'm gonna draw some of it out and pick up a little bit at a time. Oh. 
a little bit more of this clear so I can get it nice and thin so it's not, doesn't get too thick. And this is a good tip, when you're, even when you're doing your own nails, if you put your pinky somewhere on whatever you're coloring in, it makes it a lot easier to have stability on your work. It's not easy to color in these tiny, <laughs> tiny specks. I've just gotten really good at doing it. I've been doing art for a really long time, even before I started doing nail art. So I've got pretty steady hands as long as my blood pressure is in check. There's a little finished image. Some turtles just swimming through the sea. you can use my code manysavvy10 I'll put it on the screen if you want to get subscribed and get this box do it now you can subscribe before the 20th of next month and get this box